the satellites saying, Victor? Right now, not a goddamn thing. I lost the signal. Hey, you know what never loses signal? Paper. All right, this route right here should take us straight to the volcano. Might get a little bumpy, though. Let's get the show on the road. Okay. Right. So, what are we looking for out here? Well, the map shows all these structures around the volcano. Some abandoned outposts, a handful of watchtowers. Watchtowers? Avery was the most wanted man in the world, so if he was hiding something out here, it makes sense he'd need lookouts. And one of those towers is right on the volcano. With Avery's treasure. I see some ruins up ahead. Wait here. I'll go take a look. Oh, Victor. You still do a lot of traveling these days? Yeah, I try. I tend to pick jobs that get me away from the computer. <laughs> yeah, <it's telling> <laughs> Shocking how much of the business has moved to the internet. I mean, I bet you have all sorts of options to get rid of hot cargo now. Yeah, sure, but I prefer talking to clients face to face. Get a good read on. Hard to do that in a chat room talking to some guy in the antiquity master 37. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. Hmm. Not much to see here. Well? Ah, nothing worthwhile. Come on, let's keep going. Hey, so with our luck, what are the odds this volcano is gonna erupt on us? Zero. It's extinct. Trust me, that's the first thing I looked up when we said we were heading for a volcano. That and where to rent the cheapest format. Wait, Sully, you're telling me that you actually did some research? Can't let you be the know-it-all every time. Ah! Refreshing! Would you look at that? A secret cave behind a waterfall. Gentlemen, we are on a pirate adventure. What are you, seven? So, Victor, how is it that you know King's Bay so well? Well, first time out here was for a swap. Stole the diamond. <laughs> of course. You know, man, I got arrested. Enough bribing the police chief. Again, of course. And in the process of negotiating the bribe, we, uh, we hit it off. And I made it a point to come visit him. Well, maybe we can preempt any trouble we might get into. Can you still reach out to him? Her. Oh, my mistake. <laughs> no, it wasn't like that. for once. We just saw the world in similar ways. Besides, she moved. Brazil. It's a, note. Been a few years since we've seen each other. Well, maybe time for a visit. Maybe. First, let's wrap this up. All right, let's get moving. A little warning next time. That's the first time in years I've had two showers in one day. <clears throat> Sorry. That bridge there is what you would call rickety. Who well, we made these cables? Must be a trail marker. Let's keep an eye out for them. Uh, this looks promising. Come on, come on, baby. Let's go, 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 go! Made it!
okay, kid. Just don't drop us. I just keep, keep it slow. Keep it in the center. Yeah, there's a lot of backseat driving going. <laughs> We're good. Everything's good. Jesus Christ. Onward and upward. Easy. Ah, we're getting nowhere fast. You need traction here. <laughs> I got mud in my mouth. <laughs> Nathan, the rocks. I got it. I got it. the hang of this. There we go. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, my spine. Look, tire tracks. Someone came up this way. Hey, look up there on the hill. Got a tower or something. Now we're talking. What were you arguing with the rental guy? There's a path at the mouth of that stream up there. Hey, take this slow, kid. Yeah. So, Nathan, you're thinking Avery, too, and some other big shark pirates pulled their treasure and came out here because... Why exactly? Who knows? Maybe for protection? British authorities were closing in on him. Sure. Maybe uh, he helped them disappear. I mean, the guy clearly had a knack for hiding things. Let's go check out that tower. I'll come with you. It's in pretty good shape for something several hundred years old. Yeah. They're definitely ruins from Avery's era. Sam, look. That's Christopher Condon's sigil. He's uh, captain of the Fiery Dragon, operated out of Madagascar around Avery's time. So maybe Avery recruits pirate captains to what be his lookouts? That don't make any sense. No, it doesn't. Well, maybe each captain was responsible for a tower. Well, along with providing the men for it. Whatever the case, this certainly isn't our final stop on our tour.
Got some big plans for this winch. Do it. <clears throat> yeah. All right, ready? Give it a shot. Here we go. Steady. Steady. Sully? Winch. Totally worth it. We cleared a hill. It hasn't exactly paid for itself. Well, not yet. Small victories. Yeah, well, I'll celebrate the big ones. Feast your eyes, gentlemen. Wow. Spectacular. Just imagine. You've come here, a well-to-do pirate far away from your oppressive government. Ha ha ha, poor oppressed pirates. All they wanted to do was to murder and pillage in peace. No, no, they wanted to live as free men. Well, if you're gonna pick a place to run away from society, you could do a lot worse than here. It's taken forever to get to this volcano. Patience, Victor, patience. Do you know how those pirates got here? They had to start in England, sail to Brazil, then cut back across the Atlantic to South Africa. Sam. And they figured all that out with paper, charts, and by looking at the We'll be right sun. back. Uh, okay, so uh, you're not interested. I am. Just checking something out. Sorry, you were saying? Um, oh, right. And they figured all that out with paper, charts, and by looking at the stars. Hey, you're describing sailing to a former squid. The point is, we got it pretty easy. Yeah. Still taking a long time. Hey, Nathan, check out that cave there. All right, one sec. You got something, kid? I'm good. Let's go. Yeah, so much for that rock pile. Technically, it's called a cairn. Yeah, I, I don't like to say that word. It just sounds weird. Cair cairn. Cairn. Oh, shit. Stop. Stop. I see him. What do we got? Military types poking around. Nadine's guys? Yep. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Looks like they found an old colony outpost. But the wrong one, right? That's the good news. That means it's bad news. The only route to the volcano is straight through them. Oh, shit. You do have the drop on them. What's the play here, Nathan? Just follow my lead.
How's it? You have that dungus hooked up yet? We're all set up. Just waiting on approval from Nadine to blow it. Good. The place looks empty. I'd like to get it over with and move on. So how long we posted? Yeah. Two orders come in. Any news from the other sites? <laughs> Nothing yet. We can call them and let them know we're ready. The orders are to sit tight, so we sit tight. Wait for the Just put me in charge. I'll get the whole thing done in half the time. Considering the last time you handled explosives, you nearly blew up everyone in the street. I'd say it's a good thing you're not in charge. Half the time. I'll be sure to run that way. <laughs> Okay, I think that's it. God damn it. Rafe and Nadine must have dozens of guys out here. I mean, they, they could just stumble onto the treasure through blind luck. Look, another sigil. Huh. Adam Baldridge. He ran King's Bay for a while. He was a traitor, slaver, general scoundrel. Look at you. Yeah. Prison. A lot of books. Jesus, these pirates really need to work on their infrastructure. Now, how do we get out of here? Ah! 
Again with the winch, Sully. Pretty handy, right? I wasn't against getting the winch. I was against getting ripped off. <clears throat> Sully, just how well do you know Nadine? Why? I was thinking maybe you can contact her, convince her to call off her goons. <laughs> yeah, right. What if we promise her a bigger cut than Ray? No, that's not how she operates. She's more of a money up front kind of mercenary. Look, shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. Singing the same damn thing. What if they found the treasure already? Well, look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they'd found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Hey, Sam, you don't mind me asking, how'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know, reading, mostly. There was this one guard, saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? <laughs> History, uh... I'll be right back. Uh, uh, Nathan? <laughs> yeah, I excuse me. All right, all done. So, as I was saying, <laughs> history, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates, just in case, you know. Yeah. But, you know, besides books, push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs, it's a whole lot of thinking. That's pretty much it. Hey, you think that old building's worth checking out? Sam, if you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I tried. I asked him to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. That would be because the warden saw it. I got busted up pretty bad and never saw that guard again. Jesus. I got my own back when the warden decided to room me with Alcazar. That it. Um, hey, is that a well? Well, well, well. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? Might come in handy. What have we here? Hey, Sully, throw the car in reverse. Okay, give me a second.
Damn, these pirates weren't messing around. Nothing major. I'll show you back at the hotel. Sorry, you were saying? Um, oh, right. That didn't turn out how he expected. You know, come to think of it, I actually dealt with Alcazar a few decades ago, even before I met you two. Oh, shit. How are you still alive? Well, he wasn't quite the man he is today. Still working his way up the criminal ladder then. I sold his boss a few woodcut prints I'd smuggled out of Japan. He was into shoguns and such. Alcazar was the go-between. What was he like? Soft-spoken, but intense. Like he could explode at the... Oh! oh. Looks like Shoreline found something. Go slow. You got it. Shall we pick up where we left off? Uh, yeah. So, soft-spoken but intense, like you could explode at the slightest provocation. <laughs> well, he hasn't changed much then, has he? I got Be my. Be right back, fellas. Hey, where are you going? I gotta go look around. Let's roll. Uh, Victor, you were saying? Right. I got my money and got the hell out of there. <clears throat> Whoops! So, fire walks into a bar. Okay, here we go. And he's got the steering wheel sticking out of his crotch. All right. So the bar... Uh, check this out. What if that's man-made or natural? Looks to me to be half and half. All right. What were you talking about again? Um, so... Right. So the bartender goes, hey, man, what's with the wheel? And the pirate says back, ah, he's driving us. Oh, shoreline, idiots. Hello? was it? Hey, you hear me? 
We're clear. Hey, look. Anything in that pit? Oh, check it out. Maybe there's something down there. Sam, what were you talking about? Uh, oh, right. So the bartender goes, hey, man, what's with the wheel? And the pirate says back, ah, it's driving me nuts. <laughs> ah, I love that one. Don't make me leave you. Check this out. What if that's man-made or natural? Looks to me to be half and half. Uh, Victor, you were saying? Right. Don't make me leave you out here. Looks like Shoreline found something. Go slow. You got it. Thank you. 
Put one of ours down over here. Keep searching. They're here somewhere. Check it out, boys. What is it?
Shit, you can probably see all of King's Bay from up here. Yeah. Hey, look. There's the city. And there's the river valley. I'll let you look at this. Quite the view. I just keep waiting to wake up and find myself in solitary or something. <laughs> it's all some kind of dream. Sam. Oh, no, no guilt trip. I'm just... Let's go find this thing. You bet. So, how are you doing? Yeah, still in one piece. I appreciate you coming along for the ride. And especially for negotiating with that rental guy. <laughs> no problem. Hell, I'd be lying if I said I wasn't enjoying myself. <laughs> Me too. Guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline marks? Can't tell. Well, it would appear we got here first. Let's uh, check the place out and keep moving. Hey, what do you make of the drawbridge, Nathan? A little out of place. But you don't put up a drawbridge unless you're trying to protect something. Such as pirate treasure? <laughs> Maybe. Sigil. So, do you recognize this one? I do, actually. Anne Bonny. Hmm? Operated out of the Caribbean. I thought she died in jail. At least that's what the stories tell us. <laughs> right. Avery must have invited her, too. Check this out. The hell, the stairs are busted. There's no way up to the crank. I'll see if I can find something to stand on. Be careful, kid. There's a massive tower just past the drawbridge. Biggest one yet. Bingo. Sam! Ah! Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, kid. You all right? I'm fine. You all right? Yeah. You got this? Mm-hmm. I see it. Dude, just relax. I got this. I mean, there's only one crank, you know? <laughs> Keep up the good work, kid.
Anything interesting? It's gone, whatever it was. Get that bridge down. Try that again.
Big tower on a volcano. Looks like the end's in sight, huh? Nitpick, but Avery spent all that money on towers. Would it have killed him to put a guardrail up here? Gonna take a look around. So, just how much do you owe Alcazar? Uh, half. <laughs> what? Well, he only knows about the Gunsway heist, which is worth 400 million. Right, but if Nathan's theory is correct, then there's a lot more treasure in play. Well, you should have told him it was 200 pounds. <laughs> you never tell your partner how much the job is really worth. I wasn't exactly expecting to be partners with him. There we go. <laughs> All set. Here we go. Alright, hang on, guys. Oh. 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 Yeah. Oh. No panic! No panic! on this one with my shrink. <laughs> Wait, you have a shrink? No, but I will after this. Come on, you guys are overreacting. Get the whole thing under control. Claim our treasure, boys. <sighs> Can't get in that way. Sam, give me a hand with this. Yeah. Let's see what we got here. something back here. Sam? Yeah. Let's do this. Damn. It's breaked over. All right, let's look around. Hey, careful with that thing, kid. Heads up! Oh, Jesus! I said heads up! Hurry up, 
Me too. Man, he's a... Damn, wait up! Oh, he's got a lot riding on this. See a treasure, though. Hey guys, coming. Come check this out. Saint Dismas. We meet again. So, what do we got? More sigils. There's our boy Avery. Thomas too. And that's uh. Um... That's Adam Baldridge. That's uh, Joseph Farrell. And that's Richard Warren. Hmm. Pirate captains. All right, so maybe your pirate pool theory wasn't so ridiculous after all. <laughs> all right, so, uh, let's see, what do you think the trick is here? Gotta push a button, pull something? Uh, maybe, maybe one of the arms, or... Yeah, give it a shot. <coughs> Come on. Boys, <laughs> whenever you're done fondling poor St. Dismas, I think you might want to come take a look at this. Trapezoid is obviously the volcano. The crown, that's King's Bay. We got ourselves a map, gentlemen. Hector, you're a goddamn genius. Hear that, Nate? Genius. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so if we're here, this tower lines up with Avery's sigil. Okay, so then the other sigils must be the towers from Avery's time. Well, I mean, a treasure's gotta be in one of them, right? Yeah, but which one? I count 12 towers. Hey, uh, Victor? Huh? You didn't start smoking cigarettes by any chance, did you? Looks like we're not the first ones here.
Jesus. Is that all of them? Well, let's hope so. You okay? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, over here. <laughs> yeah. Hey, what are you doing? He's confirming a suspicion. Shit. Look at this. They figured out the towers, too. Locations, sigils, the works. So now what? Now what? Now we're screwed. Okay, because there's three of us, and there's God knows how many of them, and they have a head start? Yeah, but they don't know which tower to go to yet. Less great, Nathan, because neither do we. Yes, we do. <laughs> Look, it's a little worn down. Right there, that's a match. Yeah, are you sure? Because, I mean, it could be this one, too. Crap. Uh, but still. Two beats the hell out of 12. All right. I'm gonna take this tower. You and Sully, you take that no, one. No, 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 no. No, Rafe's guys are all over these towers by now. Exactly. So if we want to have a chance to catch them, then we've got to split up. Uh, Sam, just hold up a second, will you? Nate, he's right. These towers are at opposite ends of King's Bay. Damn it. Uh, if you run into any of those shoreline clouds, you call us, okay? See you soon. Come on, Nate. We gotta hurry. Yeah. 